Berkeley, even though it's a thriving community, still has a small town feel. Neighbors know one another, there's a community to be a part of. The shops that are in the downtown here uh, are all mom and pop shops. There are no big franchises. It's got that small town appeal. It still has the Memorial Day Parade. It's got different celebrations and art festivals throughout the summer. Uh, the Berkeley Art Festival is one of my personal favorites uh, and uh, a lot of fun things happening here. I'm Mike McGinnis, Executive Director of Berkeley's Downtown Development Authority. Berkeley has a really strong quality of life. The surrounding neighborhoods are full of really dynamic families. And then we've got over 70 independent retailers and hundreds of businesses in our downtown stretch. And that really helped add to the character and flavor. My name is Bethany Nixon and I'm the owner of Rewear Vintage right in downtown Berkeley and I also have lived in the city of Berkeley for 11 years. So I always think of Berkeley as a small town but we're in the middle of the hustle and bustle of Metro Detroit. So if you want a fun night out you can do it here in Berkeley but also there's tons of options all around you without the traffic. We've been really embraced by the community and, and we really appreciate being here. I am Nicole Carlson. What's your favorite thing about Berkeley? Gotta be how nice the people are here. And the awesome city with an awesome community and you really want to be here. That's a good way to say it. I love that I have a lot of friends there and a lot of people that I can make new friends with. Yeah. Hi, I'm Scott Francis, Superintendent with Berkeley School District. I'm a resident of the community and I've been an educator for 25 years now. There's not a better place than Berkeley schools and the community of Berkeley. So when I think of our students, several words come to mind. Kindness, caring, inclusive, welcoming. I'm so proud of our kids and I'm proud of my own kids to be involved in this community and this district. We have tremendous opportunities for our kids from performing arts. We've got great athletic teams and coaches. The list is long and uh, every kid can find a place to belong in the Berkeley School District. I was a Berkeley graduate too. The schools, they've always been really, really good schools. It's hard to do poorly at Berkeley schools or hard to uh, not get a good education there. As having come through the system now with my kids, the teachers are amazingly engaged. Um, I think every one of the teachers really wants to be there, really enjoys what they do, and it, that's really awesome to see. I always say Berkeley is the town that people come back to. So Berkeley is the city of lifers, and yet there, it still attracts a lot of folks that uh, are searching for a cool community to be a part of. There's still walkability, uh, the downtown area, coffee shops, restaurants, you name it. Fun thing about these neighborhoods is it's an eclectic mix of housing stock. So you have the small bungalows that may have built in the 1940s, sort of post-war bungalows, but then there are also some really cool historic 1920s construction houses, uh, the larger colonials that might be 3,000 square feet. Uh, and now Berkeley is having a building boom to accommodate the people that want to grow their families in place here. And Berkeley's having a bit of a renaissance that way.